Natural gas extracted from the ground contains impurities, water and other associated liquids. First, it is processed to clean it. It goes through a series of pipes and vessels where gravity helps separate the gas from some of the heavier liquids. Other impurities are then stripped out. The natural gas passes through a water-based solvent that absorbs carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. These would otherwise freeze when the gas is cooled and so cause blockages. Next, any remaining water is removed, as this would also freeze. Finally, remaining lighter natural gas liquids, mainly propane and butane, are extracted to be sold separately or used as a refrigerant later in the cooling process. Traces of mercury are also filtered out. Now the purified natural gas, methane with some ethane, is ready to be liquefied. This happens in heat exchangers. A coolant, chilled by giant refrigerators, absorbs the heat from the natural gas. It cools the gas to minus 162 degrees centigrade, shrinking its volume by 600 times. This turns it into a clear, colorless, non-toxic liquid, liquefied natural gas, or LNG, that is much easier to store and transport. The LNG is kept in insulated tanks until it is ready for loading into a specially designed LNG ship or carrier. When the ship arrives at its destination, the LNG is transferred to a regasification plant where it is heated, returning it to its gaseous state. The gas is then transported via pipelines to customers, providing energy for homes and industry.